Dwayne here. Phoenix typewriter. Two of my favorite things. Rush on the radio. And a broken typewriter on my workbench. So we got to fix this. We're going to take a look at this and find out why it's jammed up here. The customer already took it apart or at least took the bottom section off this guy. But what happens here is the carriage is binding right here. And it was, and it was sometimes go by it, but I can't get it to go by it now at all. And it types to that point. And in fact, it line locks right there. Even though the right margin is way over here and it's, there's nothing on the margin rack. I've already actually looked at this for about 10 minutes and can't figure it out. And so I figured I'd just turn the camera on and, and try a little harder. So, like I said, the customer did take the bottom off. So the bottom's right here. They were looking to fix it. They couldn't do it. I'm going to take the lid off here. Squeeze it out underneath the... Maybe. Let's see if I can get it out. It's a tight fit. Let's see. Uh, carriage not moving. Well, maybe it won't. Maybe I can't get it. I don't know if this is going to come off. <clears throat> I need it to come off because I want to take the upper section off here. Shoot. Right, let me try this a little more. I'm going to flex this a little bit. I see the latch there. It's just about to clear. Jeez. So that's off. And like I said, I tried. I look back here and I cannot. It's doing a, a, an abrupt stop. And margin release is moving the mechanism back here. You can see it moving it, but it's, it's abruptly stopping. So let's uh, take the case off and uh, dig a little further into this. I'm doing this as a demonstration to sometimes when I get questions like, why doesn't you know why is the carriage jammed well sometimes there's there's no answer you have to investigate and if it's not a common deal you know there's no answer to that well, i'm not going to get the case off that one screw is down down there and plus <clears throat> i can't move the carriage over I'm going to take the screw off here and yeah, drop it out of the, the bottom of the case. It's still jammed up. And I can't get that, that screw is underneath the carriage here. Shoot. And I looked at this underneath. There's nothing underneath here. Oops. It wants to, now it doesn't want to cooperate at all. Let me see if I can get the screw. Okay. Squeeze this screw out of here, right there. I can get that off. Maybe I can get the top case off. And investigate this a little bit. <laughs> that's a tight, that's a tight fit. There's, there's a couple turns on it already. Might be, might be loose here, but uh, yeah, this is gonna. This is one of my favorite things. Is figuring out, it, especially when you have a direct problem. See if you can figure out a direct reason and fix it. Okay, that screw is loose.
Good deal. Look at this. Get right to the back of this thing. Let's see if it's still jammed up. It is. And it is abruptly stopping. Interesting. It just dead stops there. It's definitely not the uh, carriage lock that's right here in this nowhere to be interfered with. Okay. And I still think it's something to do with this margin rack back here. I still think. I sure don't see it. Interesting. I'm going to look down the carrier here. Boy, things look pretty good down the, down the pipe here. So you got to look all the way down here and see if you can see anything. See what it is that's making this stop abruptly. Boy, I don't see anything. It's tough to see. You know, the camera's not really going to show what I'm seeing. But I use, I use these words, feel, touch, and stuff when it comes to troubleshooting. And I feel an abrupt stop. Like there's two bumps now. It's probably this margin. Let's see if we can get this margin. Okay, that goes all the way over. It's got two, a bump there and a stop there. out by now. But I don't see what's happening here. Tab. There's a bunch of there's a tab rack in here. The tab rack looks good. It's not that. It is really abruptly stopping. And we got the secondary bump here. see something here. Wow. 
stumped. I do not see what this is. Had a secondary bump, so it's got a bump right there. But if you force it, it goes past that and bumps again. Huh. Huh. I love it. I'm gonna figure this thing out. It takes me an hour. Keep on looking on camera, why not? Pretty soon I'm gonna have to set this camera aside, Dylan. Start getting a little more serious with my troubleshooting. Okay, I see. When I get to the edge, it's. No, well, I thought it was moving this this piece here. This doesn't seem right. This has a set screw in it right here. It's turning. What is that? Okay, let's see. Okay, let's try to line. Let's try. Try to see what happens when I.
down there at the uh, star wheel. Looks like a maybe something. The star wheel might be broken. Boy, that won't be good. I can't get the camera in here at the same time as this uh, carriage. That doesn't look good. That seems like it's a star wheel problem. That's that's not not what I wanted to determine here. But they said that it went past the carriage at one point, and it did. When I had it, actually typed across the the carriage, which wouldn't make any sense. Oops, that clears. Working, color, shift, backspace. Yeah, it's just strange, strange, strange. <coughs> Let's see if I can see the, see the star wheel from here, right inside here. I think it makes the whole revolution you know, binds, binds up a little bit there. Right there. I wonder if that's got a, a silencer and it's the silencer is out of place or something. I see the problem. I see a problem. There's a screw on the bottom of the rack here that's not screwed in all the way. I see it. I see it. I see it. There's a screw right there. That screw is, is bumping into something. Okay, let me see if I can tighten that screw up from here. Get a tiny little screwdriver. The screw right here on the rack. <coughs> I don't see a way to get that in there, but it's definitely unthreaded a little bit. Shooting right, right through here. Is that 
piece right there. Backspace. loose I'm telling you looks like it hmm. yeah, can't get to it I, I gotta give him a smaller screwdriver let's trip this little guy I think it's loose I don't know I think it turned. That is not accessible. Okay, look at that. It went by the screws loose right here. Look at that. All that for that screw being loose right there. How are you supposed to know that? Right there. Way loose. Way loose. <clears throat> All right. How long is this video? 22 minutes since I turned the camera on. You watch this. It's going to work. Oops. Margin. Scare me. Awesome. This is it. Look at that. That was causing line lock. That was causing all the problems. Holy smoke. Got it. That screw is loose. Let's check the other one on this side then. That one, let's check that. Make sure it's tight. All right. This is why sometimes it's Oh, it's, that was a little loose. Holy smoke. That's why sometimes you can't tell. My carriage is stuck. That could be a reason that you don't know. Phoenix typewriter. Good day.